Okay, I know this seems stupid, but here we go. So right before I fall asleep, my brain gets all spongy and I drift away. And for a moment, it feels awesome. But... I set the alarm. Somehow, you always interrupt it. Okay, well, I guess the worst part of my day is when I do the dishes. Because I always do the dishes, which is fine, but then I look over and I see this pile of garbage next to the sink. And it makes me want to die. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm sorry if we're trying to do better. Okay, if you want to compost, that's fine, but you never take it out. You just let it build up and build up next to the sink. It's yeah. disgusting. I'm busy. Oh, come on, Jane. Like, I'm not busy. I, I take Lainey to school. I pick her up. Mm -hmm. I do all of the shopping, the errands. I do all the cooking. Right. What? It's not that bad. How would you know you're always working? Let's pause here and... I wish I was home. It's not I... like I'm just sitting at home all day working on my book. You know, I wish you did have more time to write your book. Oh, trust me, I try. Hey, I want that for you. 200,000 words, do you have any idea how hard that is? Especially to make them all good? Uh-huh, I, I do. Because I have done it before. Let's... What do you want right now? Mm. Do you need me to praise you again for a Moyle detective? It was a top 100 bestseller in the mystery genre. In 2012. Okay, she had to qualify. Okay. I love your writing. Mm. I fell in love with you because you're a writer. I, I think it's sexy, but I think we can also be honest that... Hey, you would admit that... <sighs> You don't even write anymore! Because I'm too busy raising our kid. You could find the time to take the compost out back. Because you, you could. want me to take out your trash? Listen to me. I want you to be someone who cares about composting, about climate change, about systemic racism, about issues that actually matter in the world. Can't you just accept world? me for who I am instead? Perhaps uh, this would be a good time to process mm, some of the... No, I think we just need to get Lainey off to college. And what? Then, divorce. Okay. So, why did you insist on counseling if you've already made up your mind? I guess I was hoping that you could convince me otherwise. You could have just told me instead of insisting that we pay thousands of dollars to Dr. Angelo over hey, here. So this is a good time to pause. Don't worry, we and can afford it. Hey, because I make enough money. Fuck! Yeah! use talking sticks during council meetings to establish order and respect. Only the person holding the stick can speak, but more importantly, whoever isn't holding the stick has to listen. Okay. You don't respect me, and you never have. Starting at a 10, are we? Okay, I have this, I, I have the stick, so I get to speak. Okay, okay so just... if you want to talk about respect, though, counseling is a test, like composting is a test. Instead of testing me, why don't you just fucking tell me what you want? Yeah, okay. I want a divorce, and I want custody of Lainey. Okay, I think you're missing the point. You want to hurt stick. me? You want to take Lainey away from me just to hurt me? Because you're abusing the stick. No, I have the stick now. Give me the you are sick. Give it to me. You're selfish, too. Ridiculous. You know what? You're a loser. I know! You turned me into one! Let go. Ugh.
parents or worse your parents my parents are okay you know what maybe we don't have to call the police you know dr angelo she didn't have a wedding ring she didn't mention anything about having children i, I don't think therapists are supposed to share personal information all i'm saying is as far as we know dr angelo she's alone right we have to raise a kid so this was a total freak accident okay okay, okay. why should anyone else have to suffer so do you think okay. just watch out here you think we're supposed to walk out of here like nothing happened? Yeah. You think we're gonna get away with it? Yeah, yeah. Uh. Well, detective would have a field day with this. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. I'm so sorry I was late, kiddo. Hey. Hey. So there's pizza on the counter, and you just watch TV tonight. Watch, watch as much as you want. When's mom coming home? I'm not sure. It's gonna be okay. Okay. I wanna tell the police I did it. Uh, what? It was an accident. And worst case scenario, I'll get manslaughter, maybe jail time, we're gonna Google oh. it. No, no, we read. No, don't do that, it's gonna be in your search history. What does it matter if I'm gonna turn myself in? Um, no, wait, stop. But, but, but I, I did it. I, I, I was holding the stick. It just happened. Mm -hmm. What about Lainey? She needs you. She needs you too. What was that thing you were saying before about the Moyle detective? Oh. <laughs> uh. We'd have to be smart about it. Wait until night when Dr. Angelo doesn't have any more appointments and remove any trace of the accident. Which no. one's the heavier no, side? You have the light. No, 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 wait. She's you... gonna roll out. She's not gonna roll out. Just move. Yeah. We move in the dark so no one can see us. Oh! oh. Shit, 
Are you okay? My ankle. No, it's just. Are you okay? He's on the right shoes. It's okay. Just lean on me. Just lean on me. Are you okay? Oh, Let me just see. Okay. Oh fuck! I can do the rest. Let me just oh, here. Oh. Just open the door. Well, we'd need an alibi. Somewhere we could say we went after the appointment that a third party could confirm. Dinner? Remember that Mexican restaurant the night before Lainey was born? Oh, of course. We could post on social media. We could tip our server really well so they remember us. Thank you. Thank you so much. We'd still have to dispose of the body, though. OK, hear me out. We compost her. I think there's a composting facility on the outskirts of town. Man, how did you know about this place? I know all those facilities because I've been leaving a lot of composting during my lunch break at work. If enough microorganisms break down Dr. Angelo's body over time, no one will ever find her. Wow, that's a great idea. Can I use it for my book? Yeah, of course. And then we'll destroy the last of the evidence. Dr. Angelo having us do that talking stick thing felt kind of racist. It's called cultural appropriation. Uh. It's cold. Maybe we should get a new therapist. We can talk about it tomorrow. Sorry. 